Hello everybody, this is Havoc and welcome to the first apparent teaser for some upcoming news for Total War Saga Troy. As we can see from this little 30 second teaser, we have three of these coming, uh, unsure how often they will appear, but we do have clues for the first one that we're going to run through just super quick and kind of lay the foundations for the rest of the video. So we see the first one down in Crete. That gives us a very good clue as to what we are looking at. We see King of Land, Ruler of Sky, the Guarding of Treasures, Feathers, a destroyed animal ruined by something that has rather large talons and a huge nest on the ground. Now, for me, the, the very first King of Land, Ruler of Sky is rather obvious to what it is. What we are clearly looking at is a griffin. Now, this all makes sense if you do just a tiny bit of research. Griffins are half lion, half eagle. And in ancient antiquity, it was believed that because the lion was traditionally considered the king of the beasts and the eagle was known as the king of the birds. So that combination, just the master of land and sky. They were known for guarding treasures. This is more of a, you know, Central Asian theme where they believe they were guarding the gold deposits over there, whether that was fabricated by those trying to protect it or they thought they saw something. There are various uh, ideas about that as well. But then also you have the fact that you have early depictions of these griffin animals in Minoan arts starting in the 15th century BC including frescoes in the throne room of the Bronze Age Palace of Knossos. And even in ancient Crete, griffins were very, very popular, portrayed throughout various forms of media. So the fact that we have this scroll starting in Crete, all of these quite obvious clues as to what we are looking at gives us a pretty obvious definition of a griffin. But the bigger question, I guess, overall is what does this mean for Total War Saga Troy? Are we looking at some sort of Crete-focused faction coming up that maybe has this behind-the-myth thing for a griffin? I have no idea how you would even do that. Um, or, and this is what I'm more leaning towards, are we seeing the beginnings of an actual mythological unit rework for Total War Saga Troy? I'm leaning more towards that because I've always said that... Uh, Total War Saga Troy should have gone one of two directions. They either should have gone completely historical and left the interpretation of the myth kind of theme behind, or they should have just 100% embraced the mythological side and just thrown in every gosh darn mythological unit in the epic or even in just kind of this time period. So the fact that we have this teaser that is very obviously showing a griffin not in any interpreted method, leads me to believe that we are about to see some sort of rework or DLC or just complete overhaul of Total War Saga Troy to embrace the mythological side of all of it, which I'm actually really excited about because it's what the game needs. The game isn't all that bad, but it could use a lot of improvement. And I think by embracing the mythological side, which not coincidentally, will probably come out with the release on Steam. You are appealing to, I honestly think, both sides of the Total War community spectrum in that we just want a side to be taken. So I think even historical fans in this historical setting, embracing the mythological side will actually really appeal to them. But I guess we'll have to wait and see what the other two things are to see if that really is true or if this first one's just kind of setting us up for some sort of false narrative. Again, there's not too much to speculate here. There's a 30 second teaser, but I do hope you enjoyed this little speculation itself. Let me know what you think in the comment section down below, whether you think we are seeing an actual mythological unit rework, or if it's something just I'm making up in my head. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and turn on bell notifications. I, of course, will be keeping up with the other teasers, once they are released, and we'll see where this journey takes us. But if it is indeed a mythological rework, you bet I'll be daggum excited. Thank you guys for watching. This is Havoc, and I'll see you in the next teaser.